my name is Alyssa Zapata and this is my project for Intermediate Embedded Systems. So this project is to help people who are visually impaired be able to touch and hear the sounds of musical notes. So they can hear the sound of musical notes but they might want to know or learn what each note actually looks like. And though they can't see, they could feel and visualize what the notes um, look like. So each of these notes has different sounds. Um, it plays a full octave, starting with E, F, G, A, B, C, and then it goes on. So um, this note right here is a whole note, and it plays for four beats. This would be a, a half note, which plays for two. This is a quarter, which plays for one, and an eighth note plays for one half beat. And um, a sixteenth note would have two of these tails, but since this is beamed, um, it's like two sixteenths notes together, but one alone would be a, uh, a quarter beat. So, all of these are um, imprinted, so you can actually feel them, they're like lifted from the canvas. And yeah, so let's get into the demo. So right now the painting is turned off. You can't, it's not going to play anything when you touch it. It's just like a normal, regular painting. But when I turn it on, which is indicated by this LED, it should now play sound. So. So as you can see, each sound has a different length based on the note. Um, so yeah, so how are the notes playing, may you ask? How are you, how am I measuring this? How does this work? So pretty much I'm using capacitive sensors for each of these um, notes, uh, which is, it's wired in the back. And so these are the readings of all the sensors um, and all of them stay roughly below 400. But when I touch them, they increase, and that's how I'm able to know when to play the note when someone is touching it. So uh, if you look at that first column right there, it's uh, like pulsing between like 3, 350, 380. But when I touch it, you see the value increases to 700. And the same goes for uh, all of them. So. When I touch it, it increases 600. And yeah, so that's pretty much how I read it. And if I were to want to turn it off, the values would stop reading because I am no longer... I no longer need those readings since the uh, painting is off. But when I turn it back on, It'll continue to keep reading. And yeah, that is my project. This 3D touch sensing painting. Thank you for watching.